What's up guys? As you guys know, I am True Trees. Today I have a super super awesome video for you guys, talking to you guys a little bit about the future update for Minecraft Pocket Edition on all of the devices. So anyways, before I get to the video, if you guys want to enter in my giveaway, I'll be giving away iTunes gift cards, Google Play cards, as well as Robux. All you have to do is let me know down in the comment section what you guys want. Also, you have to like the video, be a subscriber to my channel and preferably have notifications on so when I actually pick the winner you guys will get notified instantly um, as well as make sure you guys comment below what card in what region or what country you guys are actually from so we can get the right card to you guys so anyways without further ado getting into today's video super super important topic because if you guys know you guys have been watching my channel we haven't really had too many insanely big updates recently for minecraft pocket edition and to be honest i'm not really too surprised given the fact that we actually um have had like some crazy crazy updates in the later months of 2016 however though the 2017 season for updates is going to be coming up really really shortly here and I actually got some brand new news and information for you guys i honestly think you guys are going to be kind of interested in hearing a little about a bit more so Obviously, if you guys are playing on Minecraft Pocket Edition on the iOS devices, which is your iPad, iTouch, iPhone, you guys probably have noticed that you guys are still currently on the 1.0.3 update, and if you guys are on the Android device, it's actually the 1.0.4 update. So, technically, if you guys have the beta, you guys are playing a, an update above the iOS devices, and obviously it does include like trading and all that fun stuff and there's a lot of add-ons that are currently exclusive just for the Android beta right now however though once we actually get the 1.0.4 update into the actual hands of the iOS users I'm sure a lot of you guys are really going to enjoy the new update so anyways though one thing I really don't understand and what really gets me confused is the fact that we have not seen the 1.0.4 update on iOS devices as of yet. So obviously if you guys have an iOS device you guys are probably kind of getting a little frustrated if I was just using MCP on my iOS device I would be getting really really frustrated if I didn't have the new update yet. Personally though I do have multiple devices with Android and iOS so I've already played on the new update. And I can already tell you guys, it's going to be worth the wait. Once you guys get it, you guys will be super, super happy. However, though, one thing we actually learned is Tommaso, he's actually the Minecraft Pocket Edition developer. He actually tweeted out March 6th. He says, I think I found the solution to Entity Despawn Boys. And it turns out it was my fault. Oops, hopefully it will be in the 1.0.5. So what does this mean? He found an issue, he found a bug in the 1.0.4 update, but he didn't get it addressed before he sent it out, which in my opinion, I think that the 1.0.4 update is sent to Apple, and they're actually going to be reviewing the updates in Apple stores, in the Apple App Store, and it'll be released to iOS devices hopefully by the end of this week or very early next week. I know for a fact that they are trying to push these little small updates out in time before of the big, big update with like a brand new huge feature introduced to MCPE. They are still holding off on a lot of like the very big features to show us. Obviously stained glass is something we want to see. The iron nugget obviously and a bunch of other awesome stuff too getting added into MCPE. There's a lot of secret stuff that they are actually like keeping behind closed doors and they don't want to show to the public quite yet so i'll let you guys know exactly when i can share that information when they actually introduce that informa information to the minecraft pocket edition community so other than that though it seems as if the 1.0.4 update is actually um like in the apple store for beta testing and we have to be waiting now because the 1.0.5 update it's currently getting worked on currently so that's super super huge they're done with the 1.0.4 and the 1.0.5 update is going to be next which honestly kind of symbolizes that there's probably going to be another update after that um it, it seems like it's still gonna be a smaller smaller update maybe like a feature here and there like they have been doing over the course of the next or the last couple of updates we've been seeing there hasn't been like a really big like mark um like update uh with like some major major game changing features 
such as like add-ons and like the end and stuff like that. So no, no crazy, crazy mobs have been added yet. Just very small features that we've already been seeing in all the versions of Minecraft. So that's kind of interesting, guys. I want to hear your opinions. What do you guys think we're going to be getting in the 1.0.5 update? Do you guys still think that we're going to be getting some small updates? Or do you guys think that we're going to be getting some like really major key update that will be introduced in Minecraft Pocket Edition within the next couple of weeks here? So anyways, though, I'm interested in hearing you guys' opinion. The release is coming up very, very shortly. Just kind of cross your fingers and hope for the best. We'll be seeing something awesome within the next couple of days. And uh, yeah, so anyways, though. My name is True Trees. I hope you guys have an awesome day and remember, stay true. Peace. Make sure to subscribe if you guys have not already and hit the little gear button to turn on notifications. Once you guys do that, you guys will be alerted every single time I upload. Have an awesome day. Stay true. Peace.